George finally got it. Time for the big finish. Was George going to play in the concert with just one symbol? Well, maybe he only needed one. No, definitely needed two. Maybe George could find a replacement. Something big and flat, just like his symbol. The book was a square with four corners, and the symbol was a circle with no corners. <laughs> Maybe what George needed was a big flat circle. He knew just where to find one. was looking like George wouldn't be able to play in the pancake breakfast tomorrow after all. George needed his big flat circle to be made of whatever that was. to one of your symbols, eh? <laughs> oh, you want to borrow it? Of course, but take good care of it, eh? <laughs> With a symbol in each hand, George was ready for the breakfast. <laughs>
George could see Jumpy was right. These nuts were different. <sighs> whoa, 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 yeah? George. People don't eat acorns. <laughs> well, not usually. We prefer other nuts. You know, walnuts, almonds, pecans, cashews, what have you. Oh. If people didn't like acorns, an animal must have taken Jumpy's acorns. But which one? <laughs> Deer, turkey, crow, bear, pig, squirrel, raccoon. All these animals ate acorns. This needed more research. had never seen him before. He carried nuts in his cheeks, just like Jumpy. George thought he'd find the acorns if he followed that little guy. And Jumpy thought he'd find them if he followed George. The thing also ate flower bulbs? And seeds? stored food for winter, just like Jumpy did. At last, Jumpy had surely found where the monkey stashed the nuts. wasn't the monkey after all. <coughs> Jumpy wanted to give that squirt a piece of his mind. But that squirt was kind of cute. <coughs> and generous. Jumpy didn't like him taking his acorns. But anyone could see he was a good kid. He just needed someone to show him the ropes. Someone with experience. Someone like... Jumpy. See you've made a new friend. Chipmunks are cute, aren't they? A chipmunk? So that's what that was. Ah! Oh, my pecan pie! Uh -oh. <laughs> that may be the beginning of a beautiful friendship. Oh. <laughs> 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 
It's there. <clears throat> it's there. <laughs> Ready? One, two, three. I tell you, Georgie, Nessie is tricky. As soon as she appears, she vanishes. Hmm. How would George ever share his discovery? Hmm. <laughs> we were right here, I believe. Oh, I can go to the back of the line. <laughs> oh, no, 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 please. You would have had to me, sir. Oh, gee. Thanks. George decided he needed picture proof of his discovery. was on land, and Uncle Tam said it lived in the lake. get there. Maybe the monster could fly. It was another Loch Ness monster. There were two of them. No, a whole family of monsters. This is it! Don't be nervous, laddie! You can do it! Show these weaklings what we're made of! Right. Okay. Here goes. <laughs> Behind you, laddie! <laughs> Those are no monsters, George. They're just cows. They're Scottish cows. <coughs> Aye, they may not look like cows you have back home, but just the same cows they are. <coughs> it turned out there weren't just interesting clothes in Scotland. But interesting cows, too. <laughs> and even though George had not found the monster, 
he'd made a whole herd of new friends. <laughs> Hassan must have sent us on the scenic route. Ready to see a lot of fish? Here we go. Take a trip, see somewhere new. Learn about what others like to do. There really were a lot of fish. There was one that could blow itself up like a balloon. And one that looked like a circus clown. And who knew that glass fish had bones? Let's learn about the wonders of the world. Wow, that was fun! <laughs> Better head back if we want to get to the village before dark. <laughs> Must be out of gas. Uh -huh. No problem. Just need to refill it. <gasps> Your beach ball. That's right. Here you go. Yeah. Huh? Hmm. Uh, George, did you take the extra gas can out to make room for the beach ball? And the flashlight. <laughs> and the flares. <laughs> uh -huh. Well, I guess we'll have something to play with. Until someone finds us. <laughs> catch, George. <laughs> oh, I got it. I got it. Oh, good catch. <laughs> What the? <laughs> George, what are you? <laughs> well, look who's here. It's your buddies, the dolphins. The dolphins, they're stirring up the bioluminescent plankton. They're tiny, tiny sea creatures, millions of them. They give off a glow when they're moved. George, you hear that? It's a rescue plane. to see you, my friends. How did you ever come up with the plan to get the dolphins to light up the water like that? Um, actually, we were playing catch. <laughs> George, that was amazing. 
I'm glad you packed that ball. <laughs>